Example 2.14 or 3.14 for both textbooks. For details, please see the description below. The efficiency of cooking appliances affects the internal heat gain from them since, it, uh, since in an efficient appliance consumes a greater amount of energy for the same tasks and the excess energy consumed shows up as heat in the living space. The efficiency of an open burner is determined to be 73% for electrical units and 38% for gas units. Consider a 2 kilowatt electrical burner at a location where the unit cost of electricity and natural gas are equal to uh, 9 cents per kilowatt hour and $1.20 per therm, respectively. We need to determine the rate of energy consumption by the burners and the unit cost of utilized energy for both the electrical and the gas burners. Here's a list of the known quantities for the problems and what we need to find. And also for the assumptions, we're going to assume that the energy utilized is the same for both ranges. The first step in this problem is to identify what is the amount of energy utilized. So we're going to have that the utilized is going to be the energy input times the efficiency. Notice that the only quantity that we have for the energy input in this particular case is for the electrical range, which it gives us 2 kilowatts and the efficiency of it. So we simply take the 2 kilowatts times the efficiency that we have is going to be 1.46 kilowatts. So once again, notice that we use 2 kilowatts because it's the input that it was provided by the problem. The next step is we need to evaluate the cost of the utilized energy, in this case for the electrical part. So we simply set the cost for the utilized for the electric, and that is going to be the cost that we have for the electric. It's 0.9 cents per kilowatt hour. And for us to be able to determine, we need to evaluate it by its efficiency. So the efficiency for this particular case is equal to 73. That tells us that the cost of the utilized energy is going to be 12.3 uh, per kilowatt hour. So in this case, we need to evaluate what is the value of energy going in for the gas so that we could do the same evaluation. So what we need to find that is the amount of Q in for the gas and notice that we're going to use exactly the same amount that it was utilized since it's exactly the same for both ranges and we're going to use the efficiency so it's going to be q utilized that we had before and we're going to divide it by the efficiency of the gas so we're going to use 1.46 kilowatts and the efficiency of the gas range is the, uh, 0.38 this gives us 3.84 kilowatts. Now by knowing the conversion that one therm is equal to 29.3 kilowatt hours, we're able to also estimate the cost of the utilized um, for the gas. So in this case, we're going to have the value is 1.2 dollars per term. We also divide it by the efficiency, in this case is 0.38, and then we're going to do the conversion that one term is equal to 29.3 kilowatt hours. So this gives us 0.18 uh, dollars per kilowatt hour. From this result, we could see that the cost of using a gas range is lower than using a electrical range.